Thank you for stopping by Mary's Country Kitchen today. I will be making Chinese macaroni, which is something that I've never made before. I did look up a few recipes and I'm just going to kind of make it up as I go. Anyhow, I was at our local store last week, just a small village store, and she does homemade meals to sell. And one of the things I saw was Chinese macaroni. And so just inspired me to make it for the boys because they've never had it. I hope you enjoy it. All right, so I will be using uh, beef in this. I'll have some hamburger meat and I will be cooking that up with some ginger. And this is actually garlic, it's garlic scapes. And so that will give the garlic flavor. I'll chop that up. And then I'm going to put some veggies and I guess you could put any type of veggies you like. I have mushrooms. I have some celery, some purple cabbage and carrots. So I'll chop those up. I have green onion just to put on at the end to garnish. Then of course I've got my macaroni. I've got some soy sauce, a little bit of ketchup, or you could use tomato sauce. I just didn't want to open up a, a big thing of tomato sauce right now. And you can put in some sriracha. I also have red pepper flakes and some salt and pepper. Mmm, I'm chopping up the ginger and it smells so good. Now, normally I don't peel my ginger. It, you don't really have to, so I just leave the peel on. I have my pan heating up to brown my beef with the garlic and ginger to flavor it. And I also have a pot of water on the stove to bring it to boiling to cook the macaroni. I then proceeded to chop up my vegetables. And like I said earlier, you could use any that you have on hand or that you prefer. If you have some bell peppers, an onion, some bean sprouts, broccoli, put those in as well. And I was happy with how these ones turned out. Once everything's cut up on the cutting board, all the colors together looked so pretty and just made me happy. So my vegetables have cooked. I'm gonna add the macaroni in and the beef, and then we'll put the sauce. So I'm going to start out with about half a cup of soy sauce. I can always add more. I don't wanna add too much because it is salty. And then I'm going to add some ketchup, probably about a quarter of a cup. I'm just going to eyeball it and also the sriracha. Just put a little bit in. People can add more. Whoever likes it spicy can make it spicier. Now we'll try to stir all of this in. I did only cook my macaroni to al dente. So this is ready to serve now. I tasted it and the soy sauce was perfect. And the ginger flavor is really good. All the flavors really comes together nicely. 
and so I'll get it on the table. We'll serve it with some green onions and sriracha, and I have some spring rolls on the side. So it's now the next day and I have a little bit left over to enjoy for my lunch, but it was really enjoyed by the whole family and several had seconds and so it was really something simple to make. So let me know in the comments below, is Chinese macaroni something that you make or do you think you're going to go try it out? Thanks for watching and if you like kitchen videos, please like and subscribe so you don't miss what's happening in Mary's Kitchen. And until then, may God bless you with his love, joy, peace, and good health. Bye.